And now Jason Shakur from Outdoor Plus Radio tells his story of this year's turkey hunt. Got in the blind by five o'clock and what I did was I took the bowl and the gun and the camera and the calls, called all that in there and the decoy and got it all set up. And basically there was a lot of goblin going on all around me, but nothing real close. It wasn't long after daylight and finally a bird flew down and, and started working his way closer to me and soon I, I realized he had hung up and he was about 150 yards from me and he was on another food plot that we got and he would not move and I tried calling and calling and calling and he just would not, he wouldn't come to me. Eventually he started working his way south and away from me and I thought well this is over and meanwhile I had a couple hands on the food plot, no big deal, no toms with him and, and uh, probably 20 minutes went by and all of a sudden I heard heard that Tom gobble again it sounded like he was coming back so I got on the call and got him to answer and then he hung up on that same food plot for like another 20 minutes. I thought at that point he's hung up out there I have nothing to lose so I got pretty aggressive on the call and I wanted to get I wanted to get the hen over to me that that he was with and I figured that's the only way I could kill this bird so I got real aggressive with it and sure enough he started gobbling again and and it wasn't long and I could tell he was getting closer so I got everything ready, I got the camera on. It didn't take a couple minutes and I saw the white head coming through the, through the trees and I uh, said, well, here we go. He was about 40 yards from me and I and, uh, got the camera all set up and located and that bird sat there in full strut and spit and drummed and gobbled and did everything known to man. And he finally started coming closer because the hen started coming over my way. And, and once you know it, he got stuck in between my two windows, back and forth and back and forth, and spitting and drumming and spitting and drumming. And now at this time, I've got the camera out the window, and the camera can see it, but I can't. <laughs> sure. <laughs> and then pretty soon he worked his way through past to the other window, and now I can see the bird, and the camera can't see the bird. So I'm trying to coordinate the two together, and at this time I'm thinking, I still got the bow in my hand, but I don't want this turkey to get away on me. He's yep. been too close for too long, I don't want him to, to get away, so I slowly put the bow on the ground, I grabbed the gun from behind me, and, and uh, I said, well, I, I'm gonna have to take him with a gun now. It's too late to try and flip-flop things around again and get the camera on him. If you listen closely off in the distance, you can hear the neighbor shooting his 22. And every time, this Tom responded. And finally, that hen walked past, past the blind over to my decoy, and then he finally started walking his way into the window so I could see him on the camera. I could, I could see him. He was a big old bird. And finally, he walked in about 20 yards. And, Got him to stick his head out a little bit, made a little call with my mouth. And... Finally got him. I took 35 minutes and the problem I had was that I'm sitting in a blind and I've got, I've got my bowl, <laughs> I've got the gun and I've also got the camera and I'm all by myself. And this turkey was gobbling forever out there and like two hours this morning I could hear this thing. And he finally came to this food plot we got here but he was sitting in between my two windows and I could, he was gobbling and spitting and drumming and doing all the fun stuff and I couldn't get the camera on him, so I put the bow down and I grabbed the gun. And he finally just gave me enough of a of a window here to, to shoot him out of. And let's go take a look at him real quick. Don't forget you can catch Jason Shakur and Seth Hintz every Saturday morning from 7 to 8 a.m. on Outdoor Plus Radio on ESPN Radio Sports Fan 100.5.